Hello everybody and welcome back to Extra Holiday Games. I'm Extra Holiday and it is daylight. Yes, daylight. And it looks like it might be getting dark, but we're going to go feed some chickens because we are we, we need to we need to do that. Make more chickens. Uh, yeah, yeah, there we go. OK. And you know what? While we're out here, we might as well. Harvest. It's been a while. Things are probably fully ready. Yeah. Yep. 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 Things are ready to harvest. Because it has been quite a while since we were last up here. Like three episodes or so, maybe four, maybe even five. Honestly, I don't remember. But uh, it's been a while, been a while. Hit and it and uh, OK. All right. So the agenda for today is to, like I said, we're going to feed some chickens. We're going to harvest some. But aside from that, I actually don't know. <laughs> I think I'm going to go exploring. Uh, there's and specifically exploring above ground because we were just underground for a long time. And while I would like to find diamond, I, I, I don't seem to be having much luck in those caves that I was going about in. So although I did find other loot, which is neat, I did not find anything else, which is I did not find the diamonds I was looking for. So we're going to go look elsewhere. Mm-mm-mm. All right. Let me, uh, first, a little bit of farming. I feel like I've been rather imprecise when it comes to the difference between farming and ranching. Because, as I understand it, I, I could be wrong on this. I am neither a farmer nor a rancher, but a... Farm is where you grow plants like, you know, wheat and you know, sugar cane and, you know, all those sorts of things. Whereas a ranch is where you raise animals, typically for food. And yes, there are when it, when you think of a farm, you often also think of a ranch because a lot in the past, those things kind of went together. In fact, it kind of makes sense because when you when you have a farm, it makes it easier to feed the animals that you're raising. Just like this scenario here, like I have seeds because I've been farming and I have wheat because I've been farming. Hey, guys. All right. Um, can any of you? OK, cool. Uh, good, good, good. You're all capable of doing the do. More or less. All right. OK, so now we have more chickens, which is great. We're going to we're going to throw some eggs to make sure we have the maximum number we can have from this encounter. Don't hit. OK, I was, I was saying don't hit the any baby chickens that are coming out, but None of them came out, so it wasn't an issue. All right, we're going to go to bed now. Going to go to bed now. Uh, and we know now that going to bed does not affect the timer on chickens. I don't think. It didn't seem to. Uh, actually, I want to do not that. Wait, yes, this. I want to put the seeds in here and then the wheat will craft into more bread, which then we can also put in there. OK, 17 pieces of bread. Actually, I mean, it looks like a loaf of bread, not piece. So it's a lot of bread, actually. Uh, oh, hey, by the way, I did. Like I said last time, I did do some smelting. So I have a lot of iron. I have a lot of gold. And it, this this container is now basically full. <laughs> I have two redstone right here, and that kind of bugs me, but eh, it's fine. All right, we're going to go exploring now. Hold on. I'm going to. I'm not taking too much with me, not necessarily because I expect to find a lot of stuff, but because 
I, I don't know. I just, I just don't feel like I'm gonna, I need a lot of stuff. Like if I do end up finding, well, maybe I, maybe I should grab some stuff like uh, some pickaxes or maybe a shovel or two. Cause if I do find another cave system, I probably will go down into it. All right. And then I have, I have enough iron that I feel pretty comfortable just making. Well, maybe, I don't know. I don't know. Should I make stone pickaxes or iron pickaxes? You know what? I think how much, how much iron do we have total? We've got at least two stacks. Oh, we've got at least four stack, five stacks. Okay. Uh, yeah, I can probably afford to just be making iron tools right now. All right. So I'm going to make, uh, we've got two stone shovels, so we don't need more of them. I'm going to make another iron pickaxe. And I don't think I'll need another axe, but maybe we'll just make one anyway. All right. So, eh. And eh. Okay. We'll put the iron away. All right. Cool. We're going to go. Now we're going exploring because I have more materials to. Well, more tools, I should say. Less materials, more tools. Anyway, uh, the first place I was kind of thinking of going, I don't remember exactly where it is, but there's a little, there's a little peninsula. I think it's that peninsula, but let me double check. Make sure it's not here. Uh, oh, I'm hungry. Gotta eat to run. Okay. Uh, no, these parts aren't connected, but they're very close. All right, yeah, we're going to go to that little peninsula over there and see what the deal is, because I can see that there are caves in those cliffs and maybe just maybe those caves go deep and have diamonds. There's a chance or at the very least, it might just lead to another cave system. Although, frankly, from experience, uh, these things tend to kind of more often lead to just the same cave system. <laughs> just that's. From my experience playing this game, that seems to be like no matter where I go underground, I seem to be able to find my way, even without doing a whole lot of digging back to whatever cave system I was just exploring. So we'll see. We'll see. I know that you can travel a long distance. This this would potentially fix the problem of just running through into the same cave system again. You can kind of fix the problem of that by traveling a long distance and one of the most effective ways to do so i believe is to travel through the nether and then make another nether portal oh wow these aren't actually connected interesting well that kind of sours the mood hold on let's i'll make a cobblestone bridge because i can all right let me just yeah yeah it won't be a fancy one but it'll be here yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. That'll do. Uh, and then we climb up here. But yeah, if I went to the nether and I made another nether portal in the nether, then that would take me quite far out in the overworld because distance in the nether does not equal distance in the overworld. And hey, look. It's a cave. Uh, let's start with the stone pickaxe, actually. Uh, all right. Uh, there's the light there, which I'm kind of thinking is the better place to start. Uh, OK, there doesn't really seem to be much going on in here, but it's a neat little pathway, I think. Also a place where monsters could spawn. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, put some torches down. Also, there was just a spot right here where I could walk in, but it's fine. All right, so I found that little cave, which is neat. What if we go up top? What, what can we see if we go up here? Probably not much, really, but we'll check anyway. Now, seeing all that gravel reminds me that I need to find a spot to put a bunch of gravel. You know, that almost looks like a house by itself, which is kind of funny. 
Uh, that also could looks like it could be a house. Anyway. Uh, eh, 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 eh. Okay, just, just trying to get down safely. Like, it's not like I don't have a lot of food to heal up with, but I do wanna. I do, I do wanna save what I can if I can. You know. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's just, just get up to the top, see what we can see. All right, doesn't seem to be much crazy happening there, aside from this one block that's just kind of floating. I'm gonna put a torch there, just for navigation purposes. Uh, uh, there's also, oh, this is just like a column out in the water. Interesting. That's neat. Might have to check that out, see if there's anything special about it. Uh, ooh, this also goes down. Interesting. Okay. Is there a better entrance to that area? Hmm. I'm just gonna put a torch here just to light it up. Oh, there's some iron. I mean, if it's, if it's iron on the surface, I might as well take it, right? You don't find that often and it'll be easy enough to get back home so might as well eh. Eh. is that more iron it is more iron okay I'm just gonna do it this way any more iron down here doesn't look like it okay I mean there's a little bit here but it eh, eh. okay and some more here. Ooh, a lot of iron, actually. And it looks like this goes down into the caves. Well, I think there's... Uh, I'm going to have to build some stairs to get out, but it's fine. Oh. Doesn't hurt to get a little bit more iron. We did use some to make some pickaxes, so... Uh, Let's see, how do we want to do it? Actually, you can just get out this way. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, there we go. Cool. Uh, surface iron, take it. Yeah, okay. Mm hmm. Got it. All right. Replenish a cobblestone. All right. Hmm. Hmm. It is a curious area, this is. Though I don't know that I'm finding much that's incredibly useful. I will continue to look. Uh -huh. Okay, so there's more caves down there. There's water flowing here, which is neat. Uh, have I been on top of this? I think I have, but let's see anyway. Let's see, let's see. Alright. Yeah, 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 it's not so simple to get up here. All right, uh, where was the highest point? I think it's starting to get dark, but it's not that big a deal, right? Okay, let's go this way, and this way, and this will get us all the way up. Okay, yeah, doesn't seem to be anything special up here. Okay, so we're just gonna uh, carefully make our way down. Ow. That's not what I meant to put there. <laughs> that. That is what I meant to put. Uh, it's starting to get dark, which is concerning, but not the worst thing. Ow. We are still in a place that's relatively easy to get to. Uh, okay, so that's actually just the cave that I was in. Hold on, what's that down there? Oh, is that just water? Hmm. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna make a little entrance here. See what's down. Ow. Uh, yeah, this just looks like an underground pond. 
which is neat. Pretty neat. Eh. Might as well light it up while we're here. And we're gonna need to make a way out, but that's fine because we have cobblestone. Or I could actually just dig out in reality. I think I'll just do that actually. Oh, it's raining. Neat. I don't know what the actual effect of rain does is, but frankly, well, I'm, I'm sure it probably puts out fires, but aside from that, I don't know. All right, time to go home because it's dark and it gets a little spooky when it's dark. Uh, it's probably safer and quicker just to go across the water, right? As long as there's not a skeleton standing on the other shore. Hmm. Okay, well, we explored that little peninsula and <laughs> as I thought, didn't really turn out to. Ooh, hold on. Be much. That's what I was going to say. But I kind of forgot to pull out my map, which is kind of unfortunate because I don't think the map updates unless you pull it out. But it's fine. We'll take what we got. Okay. All right, we're just gonna we're just gonna head back home then. Real, real quick trek back home, hopefully avoiding any monsters like this skeleton who seems to be in our way. Okay, cool. All right, all right. Just gonna hop across here. Do hello, cows. Nice to see you. Uh, probably could have bred more of you, but again, we don't really need cows. Yeah. Okay, uh, let's eat so we can heal a little bit. Okay, that's not enough to heal. There we go. All right. Let's go. Ignore the zombie. Yoink. We're in. All right. First things first, we're gonna, how much iron do we have? Okay, so we need one, two, three, four, I believe. Four pieces of coal to smelt the iron. We're gonna need to make some more torches to replace what we used. Okay. And then we're gonna put away, what do, what do we even get that we can put away? Ah, arrow and some bones. Bones really should be in the other, other chest, but it's fine. Hmm, hmm, all right. That's smelting, everything else seems to be good. Okay, uh, we'll do some more overworld exploring next time. But, uh, as for this episode, that's a wrap. Uh, the soft sounds of rain.